going well while a Joe McGreeley is also at Dublin Airport. Uh, Teresa, if I could start with you, it looks absolutely awful where you are. Yes, Una, I'm coming to you from a very wet, very windy Saltill Prom. The gales are still blowing in off the Atlantic Ocean here, but really this is all about the rain. Storm Desmond is an exceptional rainstorm. The, the rainfall is averaging 70 millimetres in many areas and peaking at over 100 in others. Weather experts say that in the last 36 hours, many people have, many areas have have experienced the equivalent of a month's supply of rain, which really puts things into perspective. A lot of farmland flooded across the county, particularly in East Galway, and farmers will be assessing the impact of storm desert in the coming days. And Teresa, uh, what, what's happening in Cross Malina? We're hearing that it's pretty much cut off, is that right? That's right, and I understand as we came on air this evening, that the N59 linking Ballina to Belmullet is completely impassable, causing serious flooding conditions for the town of Cross Malina. So all of the advice is stay away from that stretch of motorway. Um, it's, it's treacherous and we will be following developments there. Um, I suppose Una Cross Malina crystallizes just how treacherous the weather conditions are here in the west and the northwest. Cannot repeat the advice often enough from the Gardaí. Don't make unnecessary journeys. Don't take risks on treacherous roads. And don't swim in the sea. Incredibly, people have been spotted in the water here in Black Rock and Salt Hill, both today and yesterday. Galway City Council say their actions are idiotic not only are they putting their lives in danger but it is unacceptable and unforgivable to put the lives of people in the rescue services at danger as well okay Teresa, we'll leave it there and let you go thank you uh john really in dublin airport what's the latest there 